Hi and welcome to Shop RJ Pacini for great deals on eBay. Today I just want to do a little intro video on my uh, what's, yeah, selling platforms here and I just want to go over some stuff that I just listed recently like yesterday and without further ado let's get right to it. First off I listed these here these are the uh, four pack buttons I don't know if you can see that there right there four pack buttons uh, and about one inches in diameter uh, for the New York Mets and they're brand new never been used or worn or whatever then I also have over here from press pass collectibles it's the uh, city field uh, thing here with uh, two cars I think one's a Ford Mustang and the other one's a Dodge something I don't know exactly but again this is brand new this has been listed on eBay yesterday and every now and then I like to pick up these Sony clock radios this one here is in pretty nice condition pretty clean They're already listed on eBay um, if you guys are interested these these items I'm going to show you have been listed already but up there so if you are interested please uh, don't forget to uh, click on that you know click on that buy it now button <laughs> and the other one I'm going to show you is a nice one over here this is a nice one this is the they're both Sony dream machines this one here it has the uh, CD player with it. Really nice. The only thing is, um, it's on this side. It the the grill here has a little ding on it. Can you see it? It's got a little dent. Well, it doesn't affect its uh, the, you know performance. It plays excellent. I tested that yesterday. And uh, if you guys are interested in checking this out, this too is on eBay. All right. And last but not least, for those who are uh, sports memory, you know, memorabilia people who like to say sports stuff. Um, Let's put this stuff over here. I have this here. It is from the um, uh, Danbury Mint, right? Yes, yeah, from the Danbury Mint. It's the Subway Series. It's a, I think these are ceramic trains, and um, goodness, ceramic trains, no doubt. And uh, this is what I have on eBay right now. Okay, I don't know what I have it listed for. It's not for much, and I'll tell you why. It ain't much for, you know, listed for much money. The top roof here is broken. So this is going to need to be restored. But for those of you out there who know how to restore this stuff, uh, you might be interested in this here. Yeah, I got the roof in here. It's right over here, and it's gonna—it's missing some post. Um, I picked it up because I figured, you know, somebody might still want to, uh, you know, have one of these here in case you couldn't. You know, maybe they weren't available. You want to have it? It's gonna need these posts here. Okay, uh, it has one over here. This one here, I don't know. This like—it uh, looks like it got. I don't know. Look, look, look at that thing. It looks like part of it's like notched out. I don't know what that's all about. Um, yeah, and it would need, let's see, one. Well, it's, I'm going to just put them once in this. It's missing one, two, three, four, five. It's going to need five because I don't count this one here. I don't know if anybody would use it. And part of the roof is here, I guess. Say this here is the up there. This would have to be glued on, whatever, however they do it. I notice people that restore ceramic stuff. I'm just not one of them. So if you guys are interested in this here, um, you know it's it's on it's listed on eBay okay um, however I will be leaving this video up even after these items sell so <laughs> I don't like to take my videos down for the simple reason is I like to keep them up there just for reference also I want to go in my store really quick here is my eBay store and if you want some good deals um, because some has begun I want to clear a lot of stuff out to try to get some new merchandise in there so I'm just going to go over the three platforms I sell on, and if you guys see anything you like, please don't hesitate to make a best offer. Keep it reasonable. I have been accepting a lot of offers, seriously. So, uh, you know, the sooner I get rid of it, the sooner I can replenish it. All right? So um, check it out. I'm going to scroll down. I'm going to show you the stuff I have here. My, this is my eBay store now, and I'm going to show you my, my Bonanza store, and I'm going to go to Poshmark really quick. So I hope you guys could stick around. These are things I have here. I have, I think, a total of 125 or something like that, I think it is. Something along that line. Um, yeah, and here's what I have right now. I got some girl stuff, some guy stuff. Not a lot, not too much on clothing. But I'll tell you, I will share this. Once I get rid of the clothing, I don't think I'm going to be selling too much clothing, girl, uh, women's clothing. The stuff that you see here, the clothing I got, is from my daughters, okay, the girl stuff. The other stuff I, I've had for rel other relatives that didn't want, they gave it to me. But the stuff you see, the girl stuff, the sneak is or whatever, uh, you know, basically the, the girl stuff, that's for my daughter. So that there, you know, I know all about them. They weren't pre-owned, well, they're pre-owned, but I didn't get them from my local thrift store as I do with many of my other items. Okay, like these here, these women's casual blouses, they're brand new. 
Um, my daughter was going to go into the business at one time, you know, get involved with eBay and sell women's clothing. And needless to say, she decided the last minute, no, it's not for me that. So she bought a couple of these here and I have a couple of blouses. Uh, I think small, medium, or large, just something along the line. For these here, the woman's casual blouse, but brand new, brand new. They come in, well, you know, they're still in plastic. Again, the girl stuff is for my daughters. This here, the karaoke singing machine, uh, singing machine here. Um, this here is a big unit, pretty big. Uh, it weighs within the box, padded. I'm not going to ship it out because it's too heavy. Um, it would cost too much in shipping anyway. I mean, the shipping is more than what the item costs. Uh, so I have this for a local pickup. But again, um, a lot of stuff, I, uh, everything I have, if you look at all my listings, I have best offers. On occasion, I will take the best offer off if I feel it's too, too low. All right? The jewelry, the shoes, the hat, this one here, like I said. Uh, don't let any of these prices intimidate you. You can save some money if you choose to do so. You know, check out my listings here. Um, you know, like I always say again, keep it fair and reasonable. And I, I will, I do work with my buyers. You know, well, I should say, in this case, my potential buyers. All right. This is a nice little setup over here. Um, I got the Sony speakers, I think it is with this here. Uh, I believe there's Sony speakers, I think. And this unit here works really good. This Panasonic, a personal Walkman player. It works really good. I'm setting, I'm putting uh, speakers with it in case you decide you don't want to have the earbuds. And brand new, a new set of earbuds with uh, new batteries that go with it. Really good. Uh, it's really nice. Tested it. Works really great. I didn't test the, the earbuds, of course, because they're brand new. I don't do that. <laughs> uh, but yeah, but the, that thing really is nice. So um, I, I, on occasion, I like to package things up like this here. This way, I can give you guys a better deal. You know what I'm saying? And you could enjoy it. I, I, I sold quite a few of these. Not a lot. But I did sell quite a few of these Panasonic, uh, well, not Panasonic, but the CD plays in general. And uh, people like them. I mean, I haven't got any complaints, so I haven't got any returns, not that I recall. But, uh, you know, I, I try to package them up when I get a chance. Sometimes it's like a mix and match. I think those are Sony speakers, if I'm not mistaken. i got to look at the ad. But uh, sometimes I mix and match it up. But, you know, you may not be a person that might not want to listen to it. So you might want to take this to work if you're allowed to. Or maybe in your home office. You might want to, you know, set it up with the speakers and the thing there. Pop a CD in there, you can listen to it. Really plays nice. It really is. It's nice. It's a nice Panasonic. And then I got over here uh, the Christian CD, five CD, you know, five CD thing here. It's brand new. Um, these little Chili the Bears, Thai babies, Thai beanies, whatever. Here's the Interplac uh, thing I'm selling here, just the jet pump, whatever unit. Um, I don't sell the attachments because, again, that's a, those are things you don't want to sell. Uh, what happened, the reason why I'm selling this here is because the uh, reservoir tank is broken on it. So I figured maybe somebody could use the pumping system. You know, the pumping system is okay. The attachments, you know, if you teeth and stuff like that, uh, those have been discarded. Uh, I'm going to probably end up buying a new one anyway. I don't, uh, I would never even think about selling stuff like that. I know people say, well, the people sell silverware and stuff. I know, well, I don't know. I just don't go that route with it when it comes to things of that nature, okay? Uh, then you got over here, again. The women's clothing, the paper tea, women's all that stuff there. That's my daughter's stuff. Here is the uh, USB wired rock band microphone. Some other stuff, some shirts and stuff like that there. Uh, trying to get rid of. I got. I sell eyeglass cases too. Uh, so, you know, check it out if you get a chance. I sell a little, a little variety, a little mixture of things. But again, once the girls' clothing stuff is gone, uh, I don't think I'm going to be buying more of that. I'm more like an electronics type of person. I like to sell electronics. Now, these things here are really good. They play well. I got it for $9.99. I don't know. They're, they're for some reason, I guess not everybody's interested in them. Uh, but they do play nice, though, okay? Uh, it is a clock radio. But if even if you, you know, maybe people don't want to buy it for, what, I don't know, for whatever reason. Uh, they're nice condition. I mean, I don't, they're not broken or anything of that nature. I just, you know, bought them to sell. And I did reduce the price on them. I don't know. Maybe the people are scared off because it's so cheap. I'm just trying to give good deals to people. Uh, then I got some more stuff here, little mods and ends and ends, you know, miscellaneous stuff. Here's a guitar here, a rock band for the Nintendo. It doesn't come with a dongle, of course. Again, you know, you check it out. I do accept, like I said, uh, best offers on a lot of these things here. Again, with the women's clothing, that's my daughter's stuff, the eyeglass and stuff like that. These things are for my daughter. This here is a little Space Explorer 10 piece backpack playset. It's nice, you know, I got this little hat here. Um, I'm not going to explain everything. You could see pretty much what I got to offer here. And uh, like I said again, folks, if there is anything you see here, please don't hesitate. This, this, this CD player here is nice. The only thing I can't get the player to work. That's why I wrote, please read the description. Uh, however, I'm throwing a new pair of um, earbuds in there as well with this here for $7.99. Uh, if not, you could always play the radio. The radio is a pretty decent radio in there. So um, 
yeah it's 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 good it, the radio works fine okay some more grill stuff here's a little handy heater uh for you know bathroom rv camper okay it'll heat up to 250 square feet ten dollars not bad deal okay some little things here atari flashback now for people that are home that don't go out you don't get to go out much you can check this thing out it's a pretty complete set you know so a good price good price you know here's a dj turntable playstation everything's intact with this comes with all the pieces in there i try to keep the pre prices low folks people say well you do it maybe for two, for two reasons you want to get run loaded well that too but i also want to give you guys a, a, a good deal too that's why i had shop rj to see for great deals i want to give you guys a great deal i know if it's too cheap to be true you probably think it, it sounds too good to be true but it's that's the gospel truth here i'm not you know I, what you see here is what you're going to pay for it and even the items that are cheap I still put best offer, which is kind of bizarre in some cases. Could people say you're selling them? What kind of profits you're going to make with such a small, you know, uh, amount that you're charging? Uh, I believe in slow nickels bringing fast dimes. The, the cheaper I sell the items, the quicker I unload them. It's a small profit, yes. In some cases, sometimes you break even, and sometimes you, you know you might take a loss on things. But it's it's to unload the merchandise, get rid of it, put put more stuff on it, maybe better stuff. And uh, you know, work it, take it from there. You know, but uh, I know, like, like I'm here. I'm putting on your best offer for this one here for Metal Levon 299. And hopefully, nobody will give me a best offer. And say I'll give you 50 cents for it. Uh, I'll just decline the offer. I got to make something for it. You know, but um, as you can see here, the prices are not astronomical, folks. Okay, some things are a little costly, like this Brother HL 2140 printer. Tested works great. It's a nice printer. If I, I have, I'm an HP guy, but I had brothers in the past, and they are workhorses. This one is a workhorse. This thing is really nice. I have a video I like to pop up to him, embed it with the uh, with the eBay description because I, you know, I don't know if you guys are interested in how to embed videos in your descriptions. I'll I'll show you how to do that one day if you want me to. Just drop a link below and say, Hey, Rich, can you show me how you embed videos in your eBay descriptions? I'd be more than happy to share that information with you guys. This here was a uh, family member gave me this here. Okay, it wasn't bought at a thrift store, I don't think, as far as I know. And again, uh, this thing works pretty good, clean, tested, everything works on it. And here's another one, well, not another one, but a Cura coffee maker. Um, this was recently, well, I picked this, well, actually, no, this was given to me. A uh, relative didn't want it. It's like brand new. It really works good. I was had it for $39.99, I dropped the price to $34.99. I might have to do another price drop. Uh, this Olivia table, a TV, this is going to have to be a local pickup too big to ship out the box is humongous i mean i have a small car i couldn't fit in i'd have to have a special i'd have to have uh one of the uh carriers come pick it up because i can't put it in my car it's way too big if you guys don't want to talk about and people might say well maybe you can take it out i'm, I'm not. you can't rebox it because it needs to have the styrofoam around it because it's going to get shipped and i know they do ship them but you got to understand folks that i don't have the proper packaging material with this here so for me to try to package this thing it might get damaged so i just figure let the person come pick it up. It's a local pickup if you're in the area, and you can save money on shipping anyway. Well, you know, that's just the way it is. I can't do it with that. This one here is follow with super fast automatic. This thing works great. Test it out. Again, offering with best offer. I'm also selling Land of Lakes retired image things here. You get two for that price. Again, best offer. Here I got a microwave, really nice microwave. This is a, a white Westinghouse. Tested it, clean, works really good. Okay, this can be shipped out as far as I know. I think I have a shipping box for it. Yeah, this could be shipped out. Um, you know, it's, it's the weight on it's going to be a little much, but I can't help that. But again, uh, if a person makes a reasonable offer, I can give it to you guys at a good price and hopefully you can save on it, you know. Remember, everything has a best offer. So it's not like you're not, you're going to save some money on it as long as the reasonable offer. Here's, I got some uh, scuba diving fins. These are made in Italy. These are size four or five. Or 425 whatever um, so these are good these are like pretty nice condition like really you know, almost like new condition a little Snoopy bank this guy's got some issues got little chips on his feet a uh, little wood stock was must have been broken off and they, they glued it on they didn't really do a good job of gluing on but it's noted it's noted in the um, what do you call it there uh, in the description here we got some Adidas women's running size shorts medium shorts here 999 and I just showed you the pins that were done yesterday uh, but this one here was done. This was done yesterday. This was done yesterday. This one, this one, and this. These are the latest ones that were added to my new listings. And if you're a person who don't like eBay, I love eBay. I've been on eBay for over 20 years. Um, you could also go to my Bonanza store and buy it there. Everything on a Bonanza is 5% cheaper. 
I know you probably say five percent. That's not really much. I know, but it's a little savings, a little better than nothing. Um, if you choose not to, maybe you might not be too happy with eBay, and you might want to say, "Hey, well, let me go to Bonanza." Same deals apply. Um, if you want to buy something, make a best offer. I will accept it as long again, as long as it's you know um, reasonable. Okay, and this is my Bonanza store. You can see it's basically almost the same setup like the eBay store. Okay. The only thing is I like it, this one here, it's continuous. You don't have to hit click the page, you know, you can move the page to page. This one here, as you keep clicking it, uh, scrolling down, it repaginates and goes, you know, to the next page, the next page, the next page, without clicking, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, but yeah, this is my Bonanza store, and uh, these are downs I have again. I believe, like I said, if I'm not mistaken, I think I have these set for 5% off. Maybe I should ante it up and take maybe make 10% off on it, you know? But um, yeah, this is what I have on Bonanza, and. Uh, if you guys are interested in any of these items here, please don't hesitate again to you know make that offer. But the, you, you're getting a little cheaper here anyway. And last but not least, um, yeah, and it's the same thing. Bonanza shop RJBC, uh, RJBC for great deals. You can see over here, I'm also top rated seller too. They recognize me as top rated seller, and it tells you over here this seller consistently earns high ratings from buyers thanks to the fair shipping and excellent service. So just to give you a little idea with that and just for I just for argument's sake in case you are new and you're wondering a little about my stuff here um, on my eBay uh, let's go over here to my uh, feedbacks uh, you click it on over here you could see uh, it also tell you well on this one here it tells you I've been a member since July 30th 1999 to make sure over 20 years of on eBay but if you see over here it says top rate seller one of eBay's most reputable sellers consistently delivers outstanding customer service okay and you can see I'm still at this time, at the stage of the game, I hope to stay that way, I'm still 100% fee, uh, positive feedback. So, and if you look at some of the, um, if you look at some of the uh, feedbacks I get, and I encourage you to check out the feedbacks. You know, when you get a chance, read some of them, maybe 10, whatever, five or 10, and just see what other buyers are saying. I do encourage that there, and some of my other videos, I'll tell people, before you purchase anything from me, uh, you know, check out the, um, Check out and see what the other you know other our buyers are saying. You know, they'll share the experiences what they had from buying from me. As you can see over here, nice and easy transaction, good prompt payment, value customer. That's from me because I was uh, ordered a smartwatch, but unfortunately, uh, I no longer had that smartwatch. It was only ten dollars, but what happened was with that, they just to let you know that the uh, battery was uh, it wasn't holding the charge, so I had therefore I had to send it back. And I had also uh, I had to uh, you know cancel out the um, the warranty for it. Uh, square square trade I think it is yeah they have a warranty on it, uh, for watches uh, below 1999 where you can get their uh, warranty on it you know for I think I only paid like a buck 54 but I had to cancel that because I sent it back to them but yeah, it says over here this uh, this here says this really cool thanks uh, thank you so much for making my paper weight out of the uh, kitchen that's when I sold in the land of lakes and uh, again if you read if you you know if you got the time you could just skin through them and just check it out for yourself you can see there's been a lot of uh, pretty much happy uh, buyers from me and uh, I want to I want to give my buyers a great service and I'm going to continue to keep doing that as well uh, so I, I take care of all the shipping and handling I do all the answering of the emails and stuff so uh, you know I will you're, you're gonna get direct contact with me I am the, the, the go-to guy and last but not least is Poshmark same thing as you can see here the banner shop our jeeps for great deals always looking to save you money like the item not the price make an offer and these are things right now i have 74 listings on here um and i am gaining followers pretty much every every now and then i'm getting some followers these are many i got 2953 and i'm following 1978 <laughs> but this is the stuff i have uh same thing same principle applies if you are not a Bonanza person that shops on Bonanza or eBay, maybe you are a person that shops on uh, Poshmark. The only thing with Poshmark is I have I don't have everything that's listed on eBay on Poshmark. Uh, it's basically geared to clothing. It's got clothing. I do throw st other stuff in there on occasion, but basically it's a lot of women's clothing here. Okay. So uh, if you guys see anything here, I should say girls, girls, and well, I don't have any guys stuff on this here, but if uh, if you ladies out there see stuff you like. Um, again, please don't hesitate to make a best offer, okay? So um, I'm just going to scroll down really quick. And uh, the same thing, this almost works the same way. It pad repaginates uh, the page. It refreshes the page each time you scroll. So these are things I have. Basically the same thing you see in eBay is what I have here, okay? In some cases, it might even be cheaper 
on certain things over here than on eBay. I know it sounds kind of crazy, right? Well, it's a different platform, and again, I always like to try to, uh, you know, stimulate sales. So there may be a times where I will drop the prices on Poshmark with certain things to, you know, make that sale. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, you might say, hey, but on eBay, I seen that lady's uh, blouse there, or whatever. You got it for 15, but over here you got it for 10 or whatever. Uh, you know, with different platform and different, you know, group of people. So uh, on occasion, I will do that there. So <laughs> if you're a lady looking for deals, you might want to go to Poshmark and, and check that out as well. All right. And lastly, uh, and again, this is a Poshmark here. Okay, same thing. Go by the same name. Lastly, if you get a chance, I also have a YouTube channel, which is growing, but it's growing very slow, but it's growing, and that's all that matters. I know I sound like I have a million, I just have a million subscribers. I would love to have a million subscribers, but I don't know if that's going to happen anytime soon. Uh, that could take many, many moons for me, because especially, you know, with the way things are, as far as like, you know, putting content out there. Um, this channel here, for all intents and purposes, is to help inspire and share. And on this channel, I do the reseller news. I do Let's Talk eBay. And folks, I'm also a vlogger. Um, however, I will drop links to this uh, YouTube channel down below if you ch wish to check it out. Maybe you may want to be a subscriber. Um, I did a lot. There's on this video on this YouTube channel has 1,000 over 1,000 I think 216 videos that I posted up. I don't. Know if that's I guess that's a total of everything else, even with this one here. But um, my video is just to give you a little brief, a little intro about myself and how I got started with YouTube. Um, I started on YouTube back in July of 2013, I believe. And uh, what happened was um, I started off, you know, setting it up, but I never really made a video. And then when I did make a video, because I was thinking at the time, what am I going to do? What am I going to have a YouTube channel about? And I, so I started off with the demo videos, intro videos, sneak peek videos. And you want to know who I really have to thank for all of that, folks? Take a guess. Well, eBay. eBay is the one that got me started here. So I got to say, honestly, kudos to eBay. And if this channel ever does become successful, I have to, I have to throw a, a big thank you out there to uh, eBay for get, helping me get started with this. I got to give, you know, give a lot of kudos to them and credit because they're the ones, because of them, I got started with this. And, of course, it curtailed it to other things as well. But if you look at my videos, the past videos from 2013 or 14, 16, whatever, um, you will notice uh, that I do demo videos, sneak peek videos, and intro videos. And I do some how-tos. I do some do-it-yourself stuff. There's just way too many. For me, it's way too many. I know there's a guy out there that has over 14,000 videos. He must have been cranking them out every, it must have been doing three, four a day. So I couldn't, I couldn't fathom have 14,000 videos throughout my lifetime, but this person has it. Um, but I have to give accolades to them the eBay that they're the ones that got me started with this. So if you're watching eBay, thank you very much for helping me get started with my YouTube channel. I mean, like I said again, I do appreciate it. And I do appreciate being on business, you know, being with business with eBay because really if it wasn't for eBay, um, you know, helping me get through this here, I probably wouldn't have this, you know, what I have today. Not that people say it's such a great achievement. You only got 749, 749 subscribers, but to me, it's an achievement. Um, and I have to honestly say thank you again. Now, with that set aside, I'm going to close this video out. Um, I'm going to be working on another video for my main video uh, YouTube channel. This is going to go on to Shop RJ Piscini. I have another YouTube channel which is going to go on to Shop RJ Piscini for great deals. This video will be on that one. Uh, but if you get a chance, you check out some of my videos. Hopefully, you'll like the stuff I put out. You know, um, you know, if you are new to that channel or thinking about selling on eBay, then you might want to subscribe to it, okay? Uh, but that's all basically I can tell you right now. Uh, I'm also on Twitter, Instagram. Uh, shh, I'm trying to get the other ones on. I'm on a couple other ones there. Um, Pinterest. Uh, it's right there. If you look at my page here, you'll see the other things there on the upper right corner. You'll see it on the right right. You'll see what says Twitter, Facebook, Pinterest, and Instagram as well. So uh, I hope you guys get a takeaway from the information I put out on that channel. All right. Anyway, listen, I'm going to work on my other video. I'm going to, you know, I, I'm going to do some of my research on my eBay listings. Uh, if I could, who knows, maybe when I revamp my listings, I can get them, I can even drop the price even lower. But let me, let me just say this in closing. Um, for those of you out there who do purchase from me, I want you to know one thing. I'm an honest seller, and I will, I will work with you to the fullest. 
okay um, I offer like I said 100% money back guarantee I do accept a lot of offers so if uh, you see anything you like don't let the price intimidate you you're never gonna know unless you make that offer so I just want to throw that out there all right um, and I'm the one that deals I'm the one that does all the shipping and handling and answering all your questions and comments so I want you guys to know you're in good hands you don't have to worry all right uh, but if you do get a chance head on over to my YouTube channel give me a shot check it out see what I have to say and hopefully you'll become a subscriber and so next time my name is Rich Bassini have a great day bye bye for now